Hey, you guys, it's Rachel here with Life of Senza. I've got the floof, and we are testing out this new blanket that I got, and I just have to show you guys. So, oh, are you funny floofy man? You get that floof. You get that floof. He's a floofy man. So, oh, he's a floofy man. Yes, you are floofy. The floofy. The floofy. The floof. He's the floof. Did you floofy man do the floofy man? <laughs> He's a floofy man. He's a floofy man. Do 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 good. Is that your floofy song? Is that your floofy song? Do I sing that song to you? Okay, so on to the blanket. So I don't know why, but I got pretty nostalgic recently. Maybe some stuff I've been going through. I don't know. Y'all know I've been struggling. And I got nostalgic. And I, like, remembered. So, first of all, I want to show... I'm going to show y'all all the blankets I got. Okay. So, spread this one out for us, Savannah. So, this is oh, a... Wait, um, hold on. Ah, so, ahead. this is a vintage blanket. Ah, it's yeah. used. Hold on. I'm trying to get him to... And... It, I want to know who really floof. Hey! Telecom. Just because it looks like you doesn't mean you should choose. Move. So, uh, nope, wrong way. No, no, it is not. Hold on. Telecom, quit it, dude. Stop <laughs> it. All right, pull it out. This is vintage, dude. You can't, not vintage. What is this? this is it is vintage. It is totally vintage. vintage. So, it's not right. I hey, no. saw this. And I was like, oh my god, this is the same blanket that I had when I was a kid. Now, mine was like, ugh, really, bro? Um, it was like a whole comforter set. Oh I had a comforter and I had the sheets. And this is, um, I forget the name of it. They have a name for this type of blanket. It's like, it starts with a B. It's a German brand. Um, no. No, floof. But anyway, if y'all, if y'all ever had this, no. if you remember, y'all, this, this, no. this blanket gave me comfort and joy as a child. I, all I can tell you is it's one of the few things I have a very strong memory of as a child and just, I still love my sleep to this day. So, but yeah, this right here, this blanket, this design, y'all, this this was um this was it and when i saw it because like i said i was feeling really nostalgic and i remembered that there were these like reversible blankets that's what i remembered is that they were big fluffy reversible blankets um but when i got it i was like "Ooh, this is not very soft like it's like it's okay but it and I'm sure that it was much softer, you know, 30 years ago, back whenever this thing, or heck, let's just be honest, almost 40 years ago, whenever this um, blanket was trending. Um, but anyway, and it was very small. And this is the biggest that you could get, literally. And it's like a throw. And I was like, um, I was like, I love this. And I ended up getting another one, too, that Savannah has in her room. Um and so I see how it's reversible, although it's not like technically reversible, right? Like it's not, it's not pretty on this side. So anyway, um, so I got this one and I was like, mm, I like it, but it isn't really what I like was like thinking. Ow, you little bastard. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. Um, so anyway, it wasn't like what I really thought that it was going to be. So I was like looking and I was like, okay, reversible blankets. And then I found Saloron, I think it's called, which is what this blanket is. And they've been around for forever. And if you know, you know, and it is, um, it is reversible and I'll show you. Um, and they're big. There you go. See how it's reversible. They're big and they're thick. They're heavy, like 13 pounds for this. And they're just ultra soft. Um, I mean, this is as comfortable as you will sleep. Okay. This is, this is, um, you know. And if you, if you are in a place where it gets really cold and you want to save on your heating bill, you get one of these blankets and I swear to you, uh, 
you will be warm, okay? You will be warm. I got Savannah one. She got the same one, except hers is green here. Now, I will say that I hesitated. Like, this is a beautiful blanket. And the art, like, as somebody who used to paint and draw and loves animals, I if, if you're going to draw animals, for me personally, I like it to be as anatomically correct as possible, as realistic as possible. And these are... These are great. These are, these are, the, the art is beautiful. It's fantastic. Um, so absolutely love this. So like I said, I got Savannah green one and I also picked up one. Um, I, uh, let me fold it up so I can show the next one. So I, um, I also got one with wolves on it and then I got, um, really, and I got Ralph. Hello. Um, Ralph is Reese's brother and he always helps me out. Um, I mean, I pay him, but he always helps me out and he's just like, um, anytime I need something, you know, he's, he's, he's always ready to help out and, and, and whatnot. So, so then I'll show you this one. Now I just washed this one and I, ah, no, and, and I, and I thought that it, can you move it? The blue one? No. Yeah. Yeah. And spread it out for me. Por favor. Um, so this one, like I said, this is called a Saloron. Um, what's your name? So, oh, the ah, no. A, yeah, no, that's what I'm saying. The other one. Bruh. Bruh. All right. So this one is another one that I just bought. Um, I don't know what the orange bits are. Hello. Can I help you, sir? Um, so yeah, so this is the one that I just bought. Really? Um, I bought it from a website that said that it said that this was the um not not me bruh I'll get you oh I'm tougher than you I'm tougher than you don't put it on him move it to the side because I have another one under this one cleared it you cleared it so this is a brand that I had never heard of before called wanu tricks and the website said that these were actually better quality than the Saloron. And I was like, okay, let's see. Let's find out. They are definitely harder to find for sure. And you have to understand that these are Korean blankets. And so... They're mink. Or not, they're mink. Yeah, they're, 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 they're Korean blankets. And so, they, bro, they, the on? designs are like culturally going to be different on a lot of them. They they have the animal ones and then they have some pretty wild, they have some, they have some pretty wild um, like flowers and stuff like that like some pretty wild print. So anyway, as far as the Wanu tricks was concerned, this is a queen size, which honestly um, it's not far off from the king of the um, of the other one, the Saloron. Uh, it's it's. It's just as long. It's only slightly less wide. I was looking at the TV. Oh, he was for a second. Um, hello. So, anyway. Um, Are you at a velocity? Yep. So, anyway. Um, no, no, no. Here you go. Um, so, anyway. So, yeah. So, bro, really? You want to fight? Do you want to fight? Do you want to fight? Do you want to fight? So when I first got this one, I was actually unimpressed. I was unhappy. It felt really stiff and firm and it was not soft and I was very unhappy and I thought that I had basically gotten kind of, you know, kind of took, but I took it today to the laundromat. I took all these blankets and all, I, I washed all my bedding today and I'm not gonna, I've learned y'all that you're better off just going to the laundromat when you have a ton of stuff to wash than being a slave to the washer and dryer in your own house because it would have taken me days to wash everything that I washed today. So anyway, the Wanu Tricks, I washed it. I used ample um, dryer sheets and it's actually very soft and um they are right it is thicker and i think that's why originally i didn't like it because it felt like um it felt um 
I think that the uh, that the oh, reason, yeah. yeah, I think that the reason why it didn't feel as good at first is because it is so much thicker, and so there's like there's almost like hairs in here, not hairs, but it's just you see that like it's see that, and so oh. there's so much more that it's like denser, and so it felt not as soft because it doesn't these the fibers don't want to move as much, girl. Yeah, he's about to piece you up. I'm testing him a little bit right now. Yeah, you're testing boundaries over here. These little puppies. Oh, did you hear him chomp? He chomped. Is that Velocity snoring? Yeah, she's a loud snorer. So, ah! Yeah, almost got your face. Look at that. Almost got your face. You better watch out. I have to get him. Watch out. All right. So, um, so anyway, so this is the Wanu Tricks. Like I said, I wasn't, oh my God, I wasn't a fan at first, but now I'm definitely a fan and it is thicker. Uh, it is a little bit different, but it's very soft. And I could see now one lady said she had hers for 30 years and it's still in great condition. And so, you know, and I remember, I remember people having them for a long time. So I'm very happy about this one. I like the design. Um, it doesn't really match my room because my room is like pinks and stuff, but I really like it. And I'll probably put it in like a spare bedroom or maybe like downstairs um, in the living room to like cuddle up with whenever we're watching TV or something. All right. So let's fold this one up and I'll show you my last one. This one is my favorite one. Um, now, I don't know what brand. I'm trying to put him on this ground. Hold on. He's being a little so I don't know what brand this is. Um, it is not as thick as the other ones. Um, but it's super. It, it is the softest blanket. Um, here. Um, here. Seriously. Fold that up for me. Move it, please. Please. <sighs> that child, y'all. She be tripping. Come on now. Get up now. Hurry now. Yeah, mm-hmm. So, um, by the way, you guys, Savannah is passing all her grades. Oh, and by the way, Savannah got asked out on a date. What? A date, y'all. Okay. I'm just saying. So, anyway, a movie, whatever. Um, so this one, I also really like. Um, just be mindful that when you're looking for a, for a Korean mink blanket, do not buy a blanket that is under 12 pounds. Telecom, quit or you're going to get you, eaten. I'll show you an example of what happens if you buy it. Yeah, this one was 12 pounds. The Solorons are 13 pounds. I think that the other one, the Wanu, is probably even heavier than that. This one, I love the color on, but it is a little bit closer to how they like to do things, which is lots of flowers and design, and it can be a little busy. But for me personally, I think it's beautiful. Yeah, so this one is the first one I bought her. We didn't know. And it's very, um, it's not bad. It's no. its still like a, like a light. It's and it's super soft. Now. Yeah, it's still super soft. Um, but it's, 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 it's not as thick yeah. as the other ones. It's like, it's... it's yeah, it's but nice. It separates. Y'all see this how it like I'll show you. It like Yeah, separates. it's two ply. Yeah, it's like see, I don't know how you can tell, but it's like the oh, that the probably nicer. Hold um on. the two sides are yeah, that's how um here, hold on. Let me flip it. I mean and this one will too. This one will separate too, but it's just thicker. This is <laughs> like we, this we, is a thicker fabric than hers is. Hers is not okay. hers is just thinner. And so, in fact, they, they show it, like, wrinkled so that you can tell, like, how thick the wrinkles are. So, it's like that. That's how they show it. And, like, this one. Well, I don't know. It's just, it see, it's how it's thicker. But it's still super duper soft. And it's pretty. It's like and, something you could carry around. Like yeah. Trip. Yeah. Like, it's still, it's still awesome. But it is not as luxurious as this one. And, um, and then the other ones as well. And I feel like what you're really, the difference is if you can see these fibers here, this like stuff, it really just comes down to the density. 
but it is, I, I mean, I'm, when I tell you that this is the softest thing you'll ever lay on in your life, I mean it. It is, it is, it's, it, it's a trap. I'm going to be honest with you. You need to be careful. Uh, you're going to lay down in this and you're going to, and you're going to, you're going to get that blanket and you're going to think, oh, I'm going to watch a movie. No, you're not. Nope. You're going to go right to sleep. And uh, if you think you're going to get in your bed and that you're going to watch TV, like I have my TV and, um, and you think you're going to get in after a long day and you're going to get up in this cozy bed and, and you're going to enjoy some TV. Nope. No, you're not. It's a trap. You're going to go to or bed. Or you think you're going to just sit down for a minute? Just no. Talk yeah, you think you're, yeah, you think you're just going to lay down for a moment? No, you're not getting back up. No. And now the only thing I will say about this one is super soft, but like I said, it does have its downside. It sheds. It doesn't shed like a whole lot. And I do think that part of this is the fact that my cat loves. Oh, that's another thing is that once you get these blankets, your cat will never, ever sleep alone again the cat is gonna gonna is gonna want to be right on top of you and they're gonna want to make biscuits yeah they're gonna make biscuits all night on you and and you're just gonna have to accept that and um and you're just gonna have to learn don't tell them to go away yeah and you just have to share the space because it's too much to ask of any living living being uh to not want um to lay down and and enjoy uh the luxury that is one of these blankets. See the little pieces. Yeah, I just love this. I wish to God that this one, like it does feel good quality, but I do wonder how long it will last me. Um, and I almost wanted to buy another one just to have in case like whenever I do run this one into the, you know what I mean? Whenever it's got bald spots and stuff from from watching it and whatnot. I just love it so much. Um, so anyway, yeah, I've been buying blankets. <sighs> Maybe I'm feeling lonely and <laughs> need the comfort of, like, I don't know. I'm just playing. I'm just joking, but I do. I have, I have quite a few blankets. I'm not gonna lie. I have this one. I have this quilt, nice, heavy quilt right here. It's nice, a quilt. And, and then I have this comforter as well. So I have I have a nice fluffy comforter. I have a quilt. And then I have this. You guys, I, I'm a professional when it comes to comfort she and sleeping. Also has her other like it this is this is heaven on earth for me. Um this is how I'm able to do what I do. You don't even spend a lot of time in bed. What? You don't even you guys under, don't understand how late mom goes to bed. It'll be like three in the morning. That's I'll not wake true. Up and come in here and be like, "Mom, why are you awake?" She's I don't like, stay up that like, late she's anymore. Like, I can't sleep. I don't stay up that late. Okay, I tr I try not to. Mind, if something is worrying her. She will not go. To sleep. <sighs> it's true. I try. She just won't. It's true. I try. I'm, I kid you not, you guys. Um, I will go to sleep thinking she's gonna go to bed. Wake up when it's time for me to go to school or get ready for school, which I wake up at four a.m. to get ready. And she's awake. And I'm like, Mom. And I'm like, I know. And she's scrolling through her phone. Just like, ah. And I'm like, Mom. Go yeah. If there's something I'm worried about, like if there's if there's some new, like whenever we were researching the color of patina, that was like a big thing for me. I was researching a lot. And I have this. Obsessive. Ob yeah, I have an ob I have this obsessive nature to me that whenever I start to learn something new or whatever, I'm just one of those people that believes that if you research something enough, you can almost get through anything, but you have to know as much as you can about it. And so like, I do like that. I don't know. Like you remember that movie, the fifth element and that girl has that thing on and she's like, just absorbing tons of information. Like that's what I do. And I'll spend a night just researching and researching and researching. And that's how I know a lot of what I know. I'm not saying it's the healthiest thing in the world, but it is what I do. So. I'm surprised you weren't a good tester, were you? No, because I overthink. I I overthink, and then as soon as I start to overthink, my brain goes blank, uh, and then I lose everything. That makes sense. But yeah. could you take a test on the information that you read? Like, say that... Yeah, like, like if it interests like, me, yes. But if it doesn't interest me, and I just have to know it and remember it, that's wherever I struggle. So if somebody told you to take a test on the color genetics and stuff like that... 
that you already read about. Yeah, then I would do great. I would breeze through it so fast it wouldn't even be funny. I would just... Because, like, when I really know something, my brain... I don't know if this is called a photographic memory, but my brain will, like, pop with the answer. Like, I can think about something that I really shouldn't even know about, and maybe I saw it once, and in my head... It'll, the answer will pop in. And as long as I trust that answer, I'm fine. But if I second guess it, that's where I get in trouble. Bruh, Tilly, you grab me those little side pillows. I. Um, Don't ask me why I'm making my bed before I go to bed. I just. You you need I did. Yeah, remember those, um, those little pillows over there? Where? On the, on my fireplace. So anyway. What are the dogs barking about? Probably Tillicum. Tilly, stop it, baby. Quiet down! Yeah, probably Tillicum. Anyway, well, I'm gonna let y'all go. I'm just, like, making my bed. I, I will get y'all a video of, um, of the new babies over at Reese's house. I, uh... I've just been, come here and see it. I've just her been. Her son's birthday is tomorrow. Yeah, her son's birthday is tomorrow. And so, uh, Jace. So hopefully, see, that's, that's how it goes. So hopefully I can be over there and get a video. Cause we're supposed to go, um, maybe go to lunch or something. Peace out. So anyway, I'll go over there and I'll try to get a video of the puppies for y'all. Peace out. Anyway, well, I'm gonna let y'all go. I hope you're having a good day and I'll talk at you later. Peace. Bye.